Hi, this is Derek with MoneyHoy.com and today I'm going to show you how you can start your own LLC for free. That's right, free. Uh, Inkfile and LegalZoom have been in a constant competition with each other and as a result they're driving prices to create an LLC lower and lower. And Inkfile has just announced that their price to start an LLC with the basic package is free. Uh, all you pay is the state filing fee, which is kind of mandatory, uh, not possible to get around. So you get all kinds of amazing benefits with Inkfile helping you set up your LLC for free. So click the link in the notes below uh, to get started. With that link, you get to sign up for free. And I'm going to walk you through in a couple minutes uh, what choices are correct for you and kind of explain each one so that you can start your LLC now for free. So let's get started. Okay, when you click the link in the notes of this video below, it's going to take you to this page on Inkfile. Uh, so you're just going to pick LLC and then choose the state in which you want to form your LLC. Uh, I have a whole separate video on forming an LLC out of state that I'll link in the comment section below. But for now, let's just assume we're going to pick uh, the state you live in and we'll just do uh, Virginia for an example. Okay, click Get Started, and now you'll see here that the silver package, which is the one I'm going to be talking about today, is uh, basically free. You can see here it's uh, zero dollars with ink file, and then there's a state fee, which you can't get around. Every LLC that gets filed in the state of Virginia has to pay this fee, but you get the uh, all the benefits of ink file uh, for free. And you can see there's a number of things that are included here and a number of things that are upgrade options and we're just going to walk through each one of those uh, in detail a little bit to explain what they are so that you can decide if they're right for you. You can skip all of those and go exactly for free or some of these you might find helpful and decide that it's the right choice for you. So anyways let's get started and I'm going to pick each one. So here uh, I'm just going to fill this out as a test. And we're going to keep going. Um, and we're just filling out our address here. Okay. Now you can see here, if you're not in an insane rush, uh, you can take a couple days for free, or you can get the rush in one business day. Uh, that's obviously straightforward, and it's up to you. Uh, to get this as low as possible for now, we're just going to go with the five days. Now, this is a cool feature of Inkfile. They're going to check all the LLC filings in Virginia to make sure you're not trying to create an LLC which already exists. In this example, we're going to call our company Super Fun Hats. And it's going to be LLC. Okay. This is the actual legal name of the company, so you can have all this other stuff after it. Uh, the easiest one is just plain old LLC. Um, here you're going to select what your business does. Uh, for this, we're going to be we're going to be e-commerce. Okay, here, um, and you'll see after each one of these, there's a little helpful uh, hint. Uh, members are the number of people that own a percentage of the LLC. I have a separate video which I'll link in the uh, notes section below on the benefits of having more than one member to your LLC. If you're married, you can list your spouse as a member. Or if you're forming an LLC with multiple folks, of course, you'll name multiple people. So here, we're just going to do two. I'm going to name my spouse as the second owner of the LLC. And here, uh, we sell super cool hats over the internet. Okay. Um, this is one thing you might want to think about. Um, you establish your formal company address. If you use your own address, uh, that won't be private. People can see what your address is if they search your company. Uh, you may not want that for privacy reasons. Uh, here, they can set up basically a, a virtual site for you, which looks like a real uh, establishment. And uh, you've got a suite number and everything. Privacy concerns, you could pick this one. If you're okay with using your home address, just pick this one. And we're going to...
going to do that. Okay, premium service. Uh, this is a bunch of different things they're lumping together. Uh, you can do each of these yourself. Uh, I talk about how to do these in the notes section below. Um, or you can just decide to go ahead and have Inkfile do it for you. Uh, it's all in do you want to spend more of your time understanding what each of these are and how to do them or if you just want to pay about 150 bucks to have it done for you. Uh, this one you can sign up yourself and it takes about 10 minutes and I've got the link below. Uh, this is just basically a contract. The operating agreement is a contract between the members on how the LLC is going to run uh, for things like votes and things like that. Uh, you can download templates of these just by Googling them or Inkfile has a standard uh, template for you which you can use. Uh, banking is much the same thing. It's basically just agreement between the members, how you're going to set up the banking, who's allowed to access the funds, who's allowed to sign, and all that kind of stuff. Uh, we talked about express filing already. This is express shipping for all your documents. Uh, if you're in a real hurry to get your LLC going, uh, you could pay for that. And then business contract templates. Uh, a lot of these you can just download off of Google if you're searching for whatever particular contract you want. Or you can just pay to get all of these included. Uh, if you're not a lawyer or you're not experienced with this, a lot of these can be a little complicated, so you might want to think about this one. Um, otherwise, if you know the exact agreement you're looking for down the road, you can just Google it and there's plenty of examples. So I'll let you decide there. So here's where you decide, do you want to pay the 150 bucks for all this stuff or just skip on? Uh, just to show the freeness of this, we're going to skip on without paying for any of it. Here, uh, we're going to do the two members, which we talked about. So the first one's going to be me. I'm going to own 90% of it. So we're going to use same address. Member two, uh, we're just going to say is my spouse for now. Okay? They're going to have the remainder, which is 10%. Okay. Now we're done with that. Now registered agent. Uh, this one is a little interesting. I have a whole separate video on what is a registered agent, and I'll link that in the notes section below. A uh, registered agent is basically a physical address in the state in which you're filing your LLC uh, that needs to be open during normal business hours to accept mail. Uh, so if you are, let's say you live in Virginia, you're registering your LLC in Virginia, you can use your own address as this, no problem. Um, if you are filing an LLC in a different state than which you live, you have to get a registered agent. Now, you can do that through a registered agent service. Uh, you can Google your own, or I've got a video in the notes section below on a registered agent service I recommend. Or you can go through Inkfile and use their registered agent service. Uh, about all of these range anywhere from 100 bucks to 150 bucks. So if you don't want to use your own address uh, just for privacy reasons, or you're filing out of state, uh, you have to have a registered agent, consider Inkfile, um, you get the first year free. And then from that point, you can either continue on or switch to a different registered agent. Uh, it's very easy to switch through your state corporation commission website, so don't worry about it if you want to go with Inkfile for now and then switch to someone down the road. Here... We're just going to act as our own registered agent, and they're just reminding you that you can't use a P.O. box. It's got to be a physical address. So I'm just going to use myself there. And I've been my own registered agent uh, when I registered an LLC in Virginia and lived in Virginia uh, for a while uh, with no issue. Uh, EIN, tax number. Uh, this is something you can file for in about 10 minutes yourself. I've got a link below uh, on how you can do that. If you decide to go with Inkfile, uh, they'll handle it for you kind of automatically. It's nothing for you to worry about, uh, so you can decide there. Uh, for me, I would rather go the cheap route, but some people like this option just because it's uh, less hassle. So that's up to you. Okay, this one is Inkfile's partnered with Bank of America to set up a small business checking account. 
so that can be very convenient for folks uh, just to get all this set up in uh, one kind of quick step. The credit union has low to no fees, so you just have to decide who you'd like to bank with. At this point in time, we're just going to say no, not at this time. And I'm going to set up my own bank account on my own, uh, going to a credit union. This one here is they're going to send you all your documents, which uh, you can receive by FedEx Courier Service. Or you can get it all electronic and print everything out yourself. Uh, here, this is going to be cheaper, obviously, in that it's free. Uh, this, some people like physical documents and that sort of thing. Uh, when I did mine, I actually paid for this just because I like having something in my hand and didn't feel like printing everything out. So that's a choice that's up to you. Okay, here, uh, taxes can be a little daunting at first for people starting a small business, but when you're filing an LLC, especially if you do single member or you do a member which is your spouse, it's very easy to do your taxes. All this just rolls into uh, as if you were like a 1099 contractor and you have a side business. Uh, but you'll notice they're offering business tax consultation for free. Uh, I'm going to just say no, not at this time, because I don't want to be bothered. But uh, you can decide for yourself. It's free, so it, it can't hurt you to talk to this person. Okay, this is something that you want to consider, depending on the actual uh, city or county that you're living in and what your business is going to be doing. Uh, you might need to get a business license or a contractor's license or something like that. Uh, so that can be a little bit of time to kind of research what you want to, what you need to uh, register so you don't get in trouble with your city or county. Uh, Inkfile can do that for you over here, and they'll check some of that kind of stuff out. Or if you've done the work yourself, it might take an hour or two to kind of look through that uh, and decide do you need a license or not. Uh, you can pick this one. All, in almost all cases, if you have a physical location where customers are coming in, you're going to need like a business license uh, with the city or county. But in this case, we're just like a home office, writing blog posts or selling things online. We're not going to need that. So take the time. Make sure you understand what you're doing there. If you don't understand, you might want to consider this option that Inkfile provides you. Here, we're just reviewing everything we filled out, so you can take a quick minute to look at all of that. And then uh, you're basically complete at this point. Now you're just going to uh, put in your payment information. And you're off to the races. And then once you click Complete and Pay, you can see here, uh, we've done the silver package. We've picked everything for free. You get a complete LLC set up uh, for free. All you're paying in this example is the $100, and that goes straight to the Virginia Corporation Commission to set up your LLC. Uh, there's no way to get around that. You have to pay that, whether you go through Inkfile or any other service or just decide to fill out paperwork manually yourself. So the great thing about this option now with all the competition is Inkfile – will do all the complicated paperwork for you. They check to make sure that your LLC name is unique. And everything's basically squared away, and you've got someone you can call and talk to if you have any problems. Whereas if you try to do all this stuff yourself and you make a mistake uh, and they can't file your LLC for you, you're going to lose your 100 bucks with the State Corporation Commission. So I highly recommend you go this route. Uh, again, if you've been following this video the whole time, Make sure you click that note in the link section below to get this special deal. Uh, now, if you have any questions or comments at all, uh, go ahead and ask them in the comment section below. I've helped thousands of people start their own LLC, and I'm here to answer your questions so you can start your own small business and start making money today. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe and let me know in the comment section down below what questions you have and what future videos you might want to see. Good luck.